We might just get hit with the reaper. Me Millie. Cause we in the field with them birds like we play for the Eagles. I'm on probation, so let me not talk with the legal. Switch it up. Today I woke up with my drinker. She rich as a beetle. For my teachers that's. So, <laughs> excuse me, Connor Barwin has signed and agreed to terms to play for the New York Giants. And the Giants have turned their defense from a 4-3 last year to a 3-4 this year. Um, trying to make that push to win a division and maybe get into the playoffs. Now, is Connor Barron a good move for the Giants? Of course. It's a good move because they need linebackers. They are, they got Ogletree. You understand? I think they need another linebacker out there as well. But... I made a video about him being a free agent. I just don't think, and I didn't, look, I just said bring him in if we want. I didn't say we needed him. The Eagles definitely do not do not need him. I think he's lost, he's took a step backwards, okay? He's not the same player he used to be. He's not at the end. He's better, I guess, as a linebacker, but he's horrible at coverage. He, he's not fast. He doesn't blitz well. He didn't blitz well for the Rams, okay? Now, I'm trying to figure this out because of what Connor Barwin said. He wants to play for a Super Bowl contender. That was reported. You know, if I could find this article, I will put it up right now so you can see it. He wanted to contend for a Super Bowl. Now, my guess where Connor Barwin is right now is that I don't think a lot of teams were after him. I, I think very few. Maybe not even at all. Maybe he took a veteran minimum. It's got to be a one-year fucking deal. It's not long-term. I highly doubt it. If the Patriots didn't pick him up, if the Rams didn't pick him up, if the Saints didn't pick him up, if the Vikings didn't pick him up, then I don't know. If the Jaguars didn't pick him up, then I don't know. Um, I don't know. I think this was just a really a last opportunity for him to play football, really, more than contending for a Super Bowl. I think this really, this move was pretty much, for not the Giants move, but just Connor Barron going to a team was because he really didn't have any options. Um, like the Giants got a very good, well-hearted player. I will not hate Connor Barron because he's on the fucking Giants, okay? I will not hate him. He, the Gi Giant fans, you will love him. He is, he will, he is great with the community. Fucking big ass heart. The visual individual that just that cares about everything and everyone, and, and you can't hate the guy, and you can't hate him. It's impossible, and I'll never hate him. Okay, but I understand the Giant fans are happy right now, and that's fine. I mean, look, you need you need more linebackers. You got a linebacker, cool. You, that's what you got. That's what you get. You understand, but. You know, I think he's, what, 30, 31, which it doesn't matter. What linebackers could be fucking 34 and still rock the fucking middle of the field. It doesn't matter. But, unfortunately, Connor Barn took a step back. And if he, if he couldn't even stay on the Rams roster, I understand it was a one-year deal, but he couldn't even stay with the Rams. They, 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 they couldn't even keep him there because, honestly... Connor Barwin is not the same player he used to be. He's not. You picked up a guy that you could plug in if you have to. And that's really it. Other than that, you're not getting really anything that's like, oh my fucking God, holy shit. You're not getting that, okay? <laughs> Let's be honest now. But he's a good pickup. See, I, I, yeah, yes, I made a video, okay? No, I'm not saying it because he's a New York Giant, so fucking relax, everybody. I'm not saying that because he's a New York Giant. I'm saying that because 
he has really taken a step back, okay? He's not going to get you 14 and a half sacks, okay? It's not going to happen. He doesn't blitz very well. He's slow with his feet. He's just not the way he used to be. He's very he's he's slow. He's slow with his feet. He's not as fast as he used to be. He's just he's not. With the Rams, he wasn't. Okay? He just wasn't there. I understand he was more of a D end over there, but I know linebackers his strong suit, but he can't cover anybody. He can't cover. He, the most he could do is blitz, and that's about it. That's all you're really going to get. But not the best blitzer either. He, you kind of, you, you really see him coming. You know, he's he's does he's not a fast fucking dude anymore. He's not fast, and in coverage, he's not good at all. So you're just getting someone that you're plugging right in. Other than that, I mean, that's pretty much about it. And I'm not trying to downgrade him because I already made a video on Connor Barn and said if we want to bring him in, just bring him in. Fuck it, whatever. Just bring him in. I didn't say, oh my God, let's fucking get him right now. Sign him right now, Eagles. No, did not say that. But you got to look at the Giant fans now. There are some people that are, you know, the, the team is, it's, you can't be overconfident about your team. You can't be overconfident. It's way too confident. I wasn't very confident. Like, I was, I was, I was positive, but I wasn't like, oh yeah, we're, we're taking this shit over this year. No, no, not at all. Okay. And, you know, a lot goes into, a lot goes into it, but I'm not going to get into all that shit. You know, let the giant fans, you guys. I guess enjoy the moment while it lasts. That's all I could really say. So that is about it. So Connor Barn to the New York Giants. Huh. God damn it. And I will see you guys later. Shakes gone up. Fly goes fly.